For this tutorial, I will be covering how to do simple three-point editing using Final Cut Pro. On my left-hand side, I already have imported four video files. The first thing I'm going to do is just drag my first file into my viewer where I can see it. I'm then going to hit the space bar to play it. I want to remove some of the audio at the end, so I'll take my yellow cursor, drag it all the way over, I'm going to hit I for in, notice a blue arrow mark pops up, hit space bar again, and I hit the space bar right where I want it to end. Now I'm going to hit O and mark my out point. So what this does is Final Cut Pro will cut the footage from this point to this point. And now I'm going to click and drag and bring it down to my sequence. I'm going to do the same thing with my other videos. Drag them into the viewer. Hit spacebar to play. For each one, I'm going to set my in and out points. This particular situation, I'm going to use the slider bar to move a little more slowly. I want to get it right when my girlfriend turns her head. Hit in, or I for the end point. And then I want her to just take two steps. and I can actually use the arrow keys to move the frames one at a time. Hit O for out. So again, Final Cut Pro will cut the footage here and here and take everything in between. Drag it down. Put it in my timeline. I'll do the same thing with my other two pieces of footage. I only want half of this. Mark my in and out points right here and here. Drag it down to my sequence. And take my last one. I think I'm going to use the whole thing. So Final Cut Pro has multiple channels of video. It also has multiple channels of audio. Videos on top, audios down here. There's two channels for audio for left and right speakers. Now you can see this red line above here. What the red line is, basically it means it's not rendered yet. Final Cut Pro has not really made that video yet. To solve that problem, just hit Apple R and it'll begin to render. For time's sake, we'll fast forward this section and get through it. And now you can see our final video is pieced together just how we want it.